Hi everyone. Welcome back to our channel. Today we have an eye-opening topic to discuss that you won't want to miss. Fast food, it's quick, it's tasty, and it's everywhere. From burgers and fries to pizza and fried chicken, these convenient meals have become a staple in many of our diets. However, have you ever stopped to think about what all that fast food might be doing to your liver? Today, we're diving deep into the impact of fast food on your liver health. How exactly does fast food harm your liver, and what can you do to protect yourself while still enjoying the convenience of these meals? Stay tuned as we explore the answers to these critical questions. So, let's get started. Fast food has become an integral part of modern life due to its convenience, affordability, and appealing taste. From burgers and fries to pizza and fried chicken, these quick meals are easily accessible and often irresistible. However, while indulging in fast food occasionally might seem harmless, regular consumption can have significant adverse effects on our health, particularly on the liver. Fast food is typically high in unhealthy fats, sugars, and salt, while being low in essential nutrients. This combination can lead to various health issues, including obesity, heart disease, and type 2 diabetes. One of the most concerning effects of regular fast food consumption is its impact on liver health. The liver is responsible for detoxifying harmful substances, metabolizing fats, and regulating blood sugar levels. When overwhelmed by the unhealthy components of fast food, the liver can suffer severe damage. Harmful Effects on the Liver 1. Fatty Liver Disease Fast food, characterized by its high content of unhealthy fats, sugars, and salt, has become a dietary staple for many due to its convenience and taste. However, frequent consumption of fast food poses a significant risk to liver health, particularly leading to the development of non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, NAFLD. This condition, often associated with poor dietary habit NAFLD, is characterized by the accumulation of fat in liver cells in individuals who consume little to no alcohol. The pathogenesis of NAFLD is multifactorial, involving genetic predisposition, insulin resistance, oxidative stress, and inflammatory responses. Fast food is rich in saturated fats and trans fats, which are readily stored in the liver. When the intake of these unhealthy fats exceeds the liver's capacity to process and metabolize them, fat starts accumulating in liver cells, leading to hepatic steatosis, the hallmark of NAFLD. High sugar levels, particularly from refined sugars and high fructose corn syrup commonly found in fast foods, contribute to insulin resistance. Insulin resistance impairs the body's ability to regulate glucose, causing increased fat synthesis in the liver. This process exacerbates the accumulation of fat in liver cells, promoting the progression of NAFLD. The presence of excessive fatty acids in the liver triggers oxidative stress and the production of inflammatory cytokines. This inflammatory response can cause hepatocellular injury and fibrosis, further advancing NAFLD to non-alcoholic steatohepatitis, NASH, a more severe form of liver disease characterized by liver inflammation and damage. 2. Toxin Overload The liver's role in detoxification involves metabolizing and neutralizing harmful substances, which are then excreted from the body. However, the constant influx of toxins from regular fast food consumption can overwhelm the liver's capacity, leading to several detrimental effects. Fast foods often contain preservatives like sodium benzoate, nitrates, and nitrites, as well as artificial colors and flavors. These substances, while preventing spoilage and enhancing appearance, require extensive processing by the liver. 
Over time, the chronic exposure to these chemicals can lead to liver cell damage and impaired liver function. Trans fats and hydrogenated oils, commonly found in fried and processed fast foods, increase inflammation and oxidative stress in the liver. The liver's attempt to process and eliminate these harmful fats results in the production of reactive oxygen species, ROS, which can damage liver cells and promote fibrosis. High fructose corn syrup, HFCS, frequently used in sodas and sweetened fast food items, is metabolized in the liver, leading to the production of harmful substances like uric acid and free radicals. This metabolic burden increases the risk of liver inflammation and fat accumulation, contributing to non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, NAFLD, and other liver disorders. Additionally, certain fast food packaging materials contain chemicals like bisphenol A, BPA, and phthalates, which can leach into the food. These endocrine disruptors interfere with hormonal balance and liver function further exacerbating the toxic load on the liver. 3. Obesity Obesity, characterized by excessive body fat accumulation, poses numerous health risks, including severe implications for liver health. Understanding the relationship between fast food consumption, obesity, and liver disease is crucial for addressing this growing public health. Obesity results from an imbalance between caloric intake and energy expenditure, where excessive calories are stored as fat in the body. Fast food, often rich in fats, sugars, and refined carbohydrates, provides a surplus of calories while offering little nutritional benefit. This caloric surplus easily leads to weight gain and obesity. Fast foods poor nutritional quality lacking essential nutrients like fiber, vitamins, and minerals, can lead to overeating as the body continues to crave nutrients, further exacerbating weight gain. High sugar content, particularly from fructose and refined carbohydrates, promotes insulin resistance, impairing the body's ability to regulate blood sugar levels and leading to increased fat storage, particularly in the abdominal area. Additionally, obesity is associated with a chronic inflammatory state, as adipose tissue produces inflammatory cytokines that contribute to systemic inflammation, impacting various organs, including the liver. Obesity significantly increases the risk of liver-related health issues, particularly non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, NAFLD. In individuals with obesity, the excess fat stored in the liver can lead to hepatic steatosis, the initial stage of NAFLD. If left unchecked, this condition can progress to non-alcoholic steatohepatitis, NASH, fibrosis, and eventually cirrhosis or liver cancer. Insulin resistance, common in obese individuals, exacerbates NAFLD by overwhelming the liver with excess fat and impaired insulin signaling causing further fat accumulation and liver damage. The chronic inflammation associated with obesity promotes liver inflammation, leading to hepatocellular injury and stimulating fibrogenesis, where excess connective tissue builds up in the liver, leading to fibrosis and potentially cirrhosis. Furthermore, obesity, particularly abdominal obesity, is linked with metabolic syndrome which includes conditions like hypertension, dyslipidemia, and type 2 diabetes, compounding liver-related issues as the liver is central to lipid and glucose metabolism. 6. Prevention Strategies for Liver Health and Obesity Given the significant health risks associated with fast food consumption, obesity, and liver diseases such as non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, NAFLD, it is crucial to implement effective prevention strategies. These strategies can help mitigate the harmful effects of an unhealthy diet and lifestyle, promoting overall well-being and protecting liver health. Here are some key prevention methods. Dietary modifications. 
Reduce fast food intake. Limit the consumption of fast foods that are high in unhealthy fats, sugars, and refined carbohydrates. Instead, opt for homemade meals prepared with fresh ingredients. Balanced diet. Emphasize a diet rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean proteins, and healthy fats. These foods provide essential nutrients and help maintain a healthy weight. Fiber-rich foods. Incorporate more fiber into your diet through fruits, vegetables, legumes, and whole grains. Fiber aids in digestion and helps regulate blood sugar levels, reducing the risk of insulin resistance. Healthy fats. Choose sources of healthy fats such as avocados, nuts, seeds, and olive oil, which are beneficial for liver health and overall well-being. Regular physical activity. Exercise routine. Engage in regular physical activity, including both aerobic exercises, such as walking, running, cycling, and strength training. Aim for at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity exercise per week. Active lifestyle. Incorporate more movement into your daily routine by taking the stairs, walking instead of driving short distances, and participating in recreational activities. Behavioral interventions. Mindful eating. Practice mindful eating by paying attention to hunger and fullness cues, eating slowly, and avoiding distractions such as TV or smartphones during meals. Portion control. Be mindful of portion sizes to avoid overeating. Use smaller plates and bowls to help manage portion sizes. Healthy snacking. Choose healthy snacks such as fruits, nuts, yogurt, or vegetables instead of processed snacks high in sugar and fat. Hydration. Adequate water intake. Stay hydrated by drinking plenty of water throughout the day. Proper hydration supports liver function and overall health. Limit sugary drinks. Reduce the consumption of sugary beverages such as sodas, energy drinks, and sweetened juices, which can contribute to weight gain and liver fat accumulation. Medical monitoring and interventions. Regular check UPS. Schedule regular health checkups, including liver function tests and imaging studies to monitor liver health and detect any early signs of liver disease. Professional guidance. Seek advice from healthcare professionals, including dietitians and physicians, to develop personalized dietary and exercise plans. Medical interventions. In cases of severe obesity or advanced liver disease, medical or surgical interventions such as pharmacotherapy or bariatric surgery may be necessary. These should be discussed with a healthcare provider. Avoidance of toxins. Reduce exposure. Limit exposure to environmental toxins and chemicals found in certain food packaging materials, such as bisphenol A, BPA, and phthalates. Choose fresh, whole foods over processed and packaged options. Safe food practices. Practice safe food handling and storage to avoid contamination and reduce the intake of preservatives and additives. In conclusion, understanding the harmful effects of fast food on our liver and overall health is crucial. By making informed food choices, adopting a balanced diet, staying active, and practicing mindful eating, we can significantly reduce the risk of obesity and liver diseases. Remember, small changes in our daily habits can lead to big improvements in our health. So, let's take action today to protect our liver and enjoy a healthier life. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more health tips and insights. Hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest videos. Thank you for watching and take care of your health.